earth, kneel before me, for I am Zeus, king of the gods. Now listen as I regale you all with the story of love, passion, and strength. This is the story of my son, Hercules. Yes, sir, tell us, tell us. Hercules, Hercules, Baza, Hercules, Kalu, Kale. Hey guys, welcome back to Bugs Galore and More with me, your host, Denise. Okay, so as you guys can see from that kooky introduction, today we're going to be talking about a bug that's really, really exciting. Um, and it's the Hercules Beetle! <laughs> Those are my uh, <laughs> my body bodybuilding poses. Do you guys like them? <laughs> I think they make Arnold Schwarzenegger proud, or Jay Cutler, or Kai Green. Yeah, those are probably the only names I know. Okay, so the binomial name of the Hercules beetle is Dynastes Hercules. It's a species of the rhinoceros beetle that is native to the rainforests of South America, uh, Central America, and the Lesser Antilles. Now you're probably wondering, where's the Lesser Antilles? Well, that's all right, I've attached the picture. So it is one of the longest extant species of beetle in the world, and it's also uh, one of the largest flying insects in the world. Whoa! So the adult body size is varied between 50 and 85 millimeter in length and 29 and 42 millimeter in width. Although the male Hercules beetles may reach up to 17.5 centimeters in length, including the horn, thus making them the longest species of beetle in the world. Now let's talk about this horn. Um, so generally, the horn does vary in size and it's going to depend on um, genetic dispositions with nutrition, stress, etc. Only male beetles have this horn. So the body of the males is black with the exception of the elytra. Now the elytra is a hardened forewing of the beetle um, and it can have shades of olive green. They have a black suture with sparsely distributed black spots everywhere else on the elytra. The elytra may also have slightly iridescent coloration, um, which does vary between specimens and may be affected by the humidity of the local environment in which they develop. So at a low humidity, the elytra, um, again, which is the hard, the hardened forewing, um, it's olive green to yellow in color, but can darken to black at higher humidity due to changes in light refraction. So the female's Hercules beetle, um, they have a punctured elytra, which are usually entirely black, but sometimes can have um, the last quarter colored in the same way as the males. So what do they feed on, you may wonder? Well, they feed on typically fresh and rotting fruits. They don't feed on humans, thank goodness. They are nocturnal creatures. Uh, they forage for fruit at night and hide or burrow within the leaf litter during the day. So the mating season for adults typically occurs during the rainy season, which is approximately July to December. Um, the females, uh, they may lay up to 100 eggs on the ground or on dead wood. And then once hatched, the larval stage of the Hercules beetle may last up to two years in duration. Male Hercules beetles typically use their large horns to settle mating disputes. These fights can cause significant physical damages to the combatants. Um, during the fight, the male attempts to grab and pin their rival between their horns to lift and throw them. And then the successful male wins the mating rights with the female. So the adult beetles are capable of creating a huffing sound, which is generated by uh, stridulating their abdomen against their elytra to serve as a warning to predators. In terms of its strengths and where its name comes from, um, reports have suggested that the Hercules beetle is able to carry up to 850 times its body mass. Wowzers! The larval stage is usually the longest stage in development of the Hercules beetle. It lasts for around one year. Um, during that time, the larva then digs tunnels in the ground looking for decaying wood that is used as food. Now the adult stage of the Hercules beetle lasts only a couple of months. Uh, beetles in this stage are mainly focused on reproduction. And the whole life cycle of the Hercules beetle lasts between 11 to 16 months. Wow, so wasn't that neat learning about the Hercules beetle? So up until recently... <laughs> Sorry, hair. Up until recently, it was thought of to be one of the strongest beetles until um, the Titan beetle was discovered to be able to lift almost a thousand times its own weight. Okay, were you guys able to guess? It's the Madagascar roach! Ah! 
Now, I know a lot of people out there don't like roaches. However, these are very interesting. And I hope that next video will help you guys um, conquer your fears of roaches and find them just as fascinating as I do. Okay, bye guys. Mortals of Earth. Oh, Achilles, Achilles. It's the longest, uh... <laughs> okay, so, the binomial... Ah! Hey! Oh. <laughs> okay, retake.